All right, Lang. So on the 29th of August, I made a video talking about all the possible rerun characters, all the characters that could come back in the months of September because they are bonuses in the Epic Raid. This is something that we've known for a while now, and it's normally, it's pretty much a guaranteed confirmation that these characters are coming back. For example, Carnfield character returned, the Arena Grimjar returned, and then we also had the Don Kenoji and Uryu banner return, and for the most part, all the characters here have returned on banners. I think there's a few, but the last two characters to return thus far, the one that we were I, personally i was kind of hesitant on returning but i was still confident that they would still return was the movie characters because as we can see here we have the movie kokuto we have the kusaka and then we also have the shurin so three movie characters and this is kind of interesting because this these are from two different banners now lucky for us shout out to hikan as always we actually have the data mind image banner image of the upcoming movie rerun banner that should be coming out in a maybe a week's time we don't know the exact date of when it's going to be coming out but it pretty much is guaranteed to come out after the mid-month banner probably a week after just to have something in the, between the mid-month and end of month banner but this is already looking like a very good banner especially with someone that's out there that maybe like these movie characters and don't have them because they are somewhat rare we don't know how the licensing is right now because as you can see unlike any other banner in the game they are covered in you know like copyright images like ksdtp bmp 2007 bmp 2008 bmp 2010 kg there's a lot of things here that you don't see in normal other banners like you know can't for you old spread stuff over you manga characters so we don't know what the licensing is for these characters movie characters at least the ones prior to the new ones that have happened this year only really returned in the month of may so this might be i don't want to confirm anything but there is a possibility that this might be the last time we see them for a very long time so maybe you might want to summon a band like this in addition to that as i did mention with this video right here we do have a shuren here as a film so that means it's very likely that him and also the center that released alongside him will also be in this banner making this a five character movie banner alongside four other fillers because it is a one featured character so we know there's a featured pull rate and we do also know that you're guaranteed a five star on step 5 10 15 20 and 25 so it's going to be the six percent rate 4.5% chance for a featured, 1.5% chance for an unfeatured, and since you are guaranteed a featured character on, you know, the guaranteed steps, if you're missing, let's say, the five new, new movie characters, you're most likely going to walk away with something good here, or something new at the very least, because all five movie characters are good in their own right, they all have a use personally you know the shuren and senna aren't as good as these three characters but they definitely are still usable to a certain extent right and they're not bad by any means and one thing we also don't know of course is the other filler characters they could throw more movie characters but i think they aren't going to i thought like they're just going to put premiums and seasonals if we actually look here I can't remember on the top of my head right now who hasn't returned in a banner because almost every single character has returned here. The White Day character returned, all the Confield character returned. This Mugetsu, I don't think he returned. Again, you can quote me if I'm wrong here. I know Rangaku, the Desert Rukia, and also the Christmas Rurika have returned. But looking here, I don't think Kisuke has returned, nor do I think the Zayapuro and also the Toshiro have returned this month. So there's a small chance that alongside the five movie characters, we could have Mugetsu, Kisuke, Toshiro, and Zayapuro. And if that's the case, if that's hypothetically the banner, again, this isn't confirmed, that's not too bad. I mean, Zayapuro is, is bad. <laughs> You don't want him, but if he's new, he's new, and he hasn't returned all too often. Toshiro is a Chronicle Quest bonus. Mugetsu is an anniversary character. Um, I think he's actually, hold on, Mugetsu I think has appeared. Let me check. All right, so forget what I was saying about Mugetsu, but the other characters, Kisuke, Toshiro, and the Zapato, I'm pretty confident they have returned thus far this month. So it's very likely they could be featured on a banner like this with, you know, the five movie characters. Now, personally, I'm going to be summoning on a banner like this because I don't have any of the new five movie characters. So going to step five, but the fact that I have like, what, a five in nine chance of getting a new character? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do five steps. I'm gonna test my luck. I'm gonna try it. I'll see how it goes. And we don't know when they're gonna next return. They could return you know, in a couple months time. They might not return until next year, May. So again, as I mentioned earlier, I don't wanna confirm or deny anything. We don't know how rare these characters might potentially be, but they are good characters. And if you are someone that's a fan of the movie characters and do want said characters, they might be worth summoning for. And we will be talking about the banner when it does officially get announced in a couple days time. My guess is that it's probably gonna drop around the 21st of September. So, that being said, let me know in the comments below if you are interested in a banner like this. Are you going to be summoning regardless of what the fillers are going to be? Personally, I am. I'm going to at least go to step 5 just to try and get one of the new movie characters. And if I can get Kokuto, that's going to be kind of exciting. But, that being said, hope you guys did enjoy this video and I'll see you the next one. Peace.